It looks like it went through the TV too. What? No way. Oh, oh and the TV. Look at that. Three, two, one. Glass just went everywhere. Well, there we go. There's a potato through a TV. Oh, look, it blew out the back of it too. What's up guys? All right, so today me and my brother and our good friend Noel, we're all gonna be blowing up some things with potatoes today. We got a TV, we got some styrofoam, some wood. All right, so you all know Noel, he's really good at darts. He was the same guy that was at uh, Franklin's with me. That was Steven, it's a new guy you've never met. There he is, you know, on his hoverboard. <laughs> I kind of consider myself a millennial and he's only three years younger than me, but he's definitely one of those generation, he's definitely a generation <laughs> Z guy. <laughs> oh, look at him. So generation Z, what is he doing? Harder than him. <laughs> Our brother's definitely a genius, so uh, he's gonna be doing some math for us. He wants to calculate how high this potato gun shoots, so we'll see. So we're all gonna make a prediction for how high we think the potato gun's gonna shoot the potato. What do you think, Steven? 320 feet. <laughs> Alright, Steven says 320. I'm just gonna guess like 290. No, 400. All right, so here's our big old potato gun right here. My dad over here actually made it for us when we were about 12 years old. He had a bunch of fun with it when he was a kid, so he was like, hey, I want my kids to have the same fun. So, it's a good dad. Had lots of fun times with this, and I want to thank him for teaching us how to make a potato gun. Ready? Three, two, one, one. go. So there we go. Where's it? It's right up there. Oh my God, I can't even see it. Tell me when it hits the ground. Three, two. One. It was 9.2 seconds. We're gonna go inside. Steven's gonna do some calculations real quick and we're gonna see how high it went and who won the bet. Alright, so according to the acceleration out of the barrel, it went 103 meters high, which is about 339 feet. Alright, so Steven won the competition. I came in second, Noel came in last. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see, a potato gun shoots a potato into the air higher than a football field is long. Yeah. So that's pretty powerful, so be careful whenever you're using a potato gun. Now let's get to shooting this TV. Alright, so next we're gonna blow up a bunch of styrofoam. I'm curious to see what this is gonna go like. We got three layers of this styrofoam plus an entire styrofoam cooler. Three. Oh, that was sick. All right, dude, so check this out. One thing to start, completely through. Second, completely through. Next one, completely through. Whole bunch of mess, completely through. Cooler lid, completely through. And they're completely through. And the potato continued and went all the way. Steven's gonna get it. It went all the way out there. It hit the ground and bounced and landed out there. That was, oh. All right, so we're shooting at the TV now. This is gonna be some glass, so we got some safety glasses. All right, so here's a good look at the TV. No cracks, good looking TV before we shoot it. Go, go, go. All right, you ready? Got it. Yeah. All right, three, two, one, go. <laughs> that was sick. All right, so the potato literally blew up into nothingness. There is, these are all of the, like, that is the biggest piece of a potato I can see. Just juices everywhere. <laughs> but the TV is perfectly good and intact. So I was afraid of this happening because I've seen people like hit these things with baseball bats and they don't even break. So these big old fashioned TVs are pretty tough, but we're gonna now turn it around and see if we can blow the back of it off. This is probably gonna be our last shot for today. Just cause we've been out here and we shot a couple guns out and we've had the cops called on us for, for this before. So we're not going to be out here for too long cause we need to put it up before the cops come if they get called. Potato boy. Oh, you got it. All right, so here we go. Steven's doing the last shot of the day. All right. You are all ready for this? Yep. Three, two, one. Wow. <laughs> Dang. What happened here? It's hit on the ramp right here, so it kind of like blew up a little bit, but it really just hit and just shot off. You can look, literally see the skid mark right there is where it hit, and it went right up there. So we didn't break the TV today, however, I think we're gonna come back tomorrow, blow up the TV, and also blow up a board. All right, so it's day two of us shooting off the potato gun, and I think today's a lot better of a day to do it. Last time we were doing it was a Sunday, uh, the Sunday before everyone went back to school, so the park was just way too busy. However, now it's a Wednesday, not many people are out in the park, there's like no one that I can see. So we're gonna shoot off some potato guns, hopefully bust open this TV, and we also got a board we're gonna try shooting a hole through. Three, two, one. That Woo! That went right through. Nice. Here's a nice pretty shot of the inside of the TV. Oh yeah. Wow, there's potato all in there. Oh, whole potato in there. All right. Well, if you ever want to know what a, like if you ever want to know what the inside of the old TV looks like. All right. Next time I'm gonna aim for this thing. See if we can crack it open there. Three, two, one, fire! Woohoo! Right on. That was. Look at that. See that hole right in the back. Oh, oh, look, it's all cracked. This is all cracked. Dang. Up here is all cracked. We're gonna go and move on to this board now, see if we can put a hole in it. Why are these potatoes so small? Oh, uh, here's the big one. All right, got the right potato. 
Three, two, one, go! Whew. Hard Dang. for it. it. Looks like it went through the TV too. What? No way. Look at that. Oh, and the TV. Look at that. Broke out the buttons right there. Oh. Wow, that's crazy. Dude, this TV is full of potato. <laughs> All right, so now Steven's turn, he's loading up the potato gun, and we're about to blast another hole in this wood. Okay. All right, so Steven isn't gonna shoot for where it's at on the TV, he's gonna shoot here and see if it can still go through without having a backing to it. He'll also be able to see how far the potato goes. All right. Three, two, hey. one. Oh my God, that would... So not only did he just blow a huge hole right through that wood, the piece of wood flew all the way over here <laughs> and landed right here. And Look at this. Where'd the potato go? Yeah, scraps of potato are laying around. There's one right there. I mean, look how far back we are. The wood was like right there. There's a little bit of potato left. <laughs> Eat it. All right, three, two, one. Wow. I just got missed it with potato. Oh, that was gross. All right, so as you can see, we hit the uh, TV, but it didn't break at all. <laughs> We're gonna get some hammers, see if we can crack the screen with this hammer. All right, let's go. Whoa. What the heck? Oh, it's a vacuum in there. Oh, it's a vacuum? That yeah, was that was weird. the weirdest sound. I'm not sure if y'all heard that, but what the? All right, well, my turn. I hit it pretty hard. There we go, that is fun. Why is there smoke coming out? What the heck is this? Dude, it's all cracking. Is there like a, you think there's like a gas in there? Dude, what the heck? Do y'all see this? There is literally gas coming out of this TV. Potato gun time. Oh yeah, all right, potato <laughs> gun time. All right, I have a feeling this thing's gonna blow up everywhere. Okay, right, three, three, two, one. Oh, I just got, like, Yeah. Glass just went everywhere. That was... Dude, all right. <laughs> well, there we go. There is a potato gun, a potato through a TV. Oh, look, it blew out the back of it, too. All right, look in here. Look at this. The whole back of the TV just got blown apart by the potato as well. So, if you're wondering why the potato okay. didn't go through it, look at how thick that oh glass is. Oh, my God. Look at that. That is, like... Half an inch thick, like look, that is thicker than my thumb. That is some seriously thick glass. I had no idea that TV glass was so thick. Wow, I am glad I had glasses on for that. All right, so now that that's done, we're just gonna beat the rest of the glass in. Oh my God. Oh, I wasn't even doing that. Dang. Oh, sorry. Dude, check this out. This is so heavy. This is like probably like three, four pounds. Oh, that is the Dude, thickest that glass. potato all splattered on Oh me. yeah, check out that potato. <laughs> Dang, why is TV glass so thick? All right, so we got the trash can. We're gonna be throwing this TV away. I just wanna say thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Also, if you wanna see me teach you how to make a potato gun like what we just shot off, let me know in the comment section. I would love to teach you how to build a potato gun. They're a lot of fun, but you do have to be careful because they are illegal in a lot of places and they're very dangerous. My dad actually had a friend who lost his eye to ones, so you really have to be careful when using it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.